Yo, what is up guys? It's Cypher here with a new video. And uh, also, in this life story, I'm just slaying. I'm not really going to be doing anything in the background. So if you guys just want to like minimize me and just listen to me in the background while you guys are doing something, then that's fine. But uh, yeah, anyways, um, so this life story is, um, this one I completely forgot about. But like last week, I passed by, I passed by the area where this happened, and it just like, it, I just, it just came back to me, you know. All right, so this life story is pretty weird, and even like, even I could admit that. So one day, I finished playing basketball at the park, like 20 minutes away from my house. So I dabbed up on my boys, and like, and then everybody left. They're like, ah, right, yo, cause it got late, so everybody's going home. So I'm like, oh, I right, yeah, peace. So I'm walking home, listening to music with my headphones on and everything. And uh, my old elementary school's up the street from where I live. So I'm walking down the street, and then I, I'm passing by, like, the old elementary school. So I looked at it because I was just like, oh, wow. And then I see an old lady in her car, like, parked on the side of the corner. Like, I saw a girl, like, right, I saw, like, an old lady right there. Yeah, so I look at the car, and there's, like, an old lady crying. So I start, I start like, walking slower, and I think if I should, like, knock on the window or help or something. Because, like, nobody wants to see an old lady crying, you know? So she starts, like, staring at me hard body, and she keeps crying even harder. And I'm like, what the fuck did I do? Like, do I look, am I that ugly type shit, you feel me? So she opens a window, and she starts, like, stumbling her words, saying something to me. And in my head, I'm like, wait, because, like, just a random person opened up their window at night trying to talk to you. That's some sketchy shit. But it was an old person, you feel me? So I was like, fuck it, whatever. But, uh, so, like, yeah, she opens her window, starts stumbling her words, and I calm her down. And I'm like, you good? And she starts telling me that I look just like her grandson who was killed in a car crash. So at that moment, I'm like, oh, what the fuck? Like, I was like, I didn't expect her to say anything like that, right? So I'm like, oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to trigger. I'm I'm like, I'm trying to be hella nice and shit. And then like, you feel me? Because like, that's just like, I just that's just fucked up for anybody to go through, you know? So like, I'm being hella nice and shit. And then she takes out a $50 bill and hands it to me. Like, tries to hand it to me, but I don't accept it. And then, uh... Hold up. Oh yeah, and then she told me to. She told me that she always used to give her grandson allowance, and that she wasn't taking no for an answer. And I said like, Nah, I don't want to take it. Like around ten times, and then like, and then like, then I finally asked her if it's okay for me to take it, cause like I just don't want to take something like from her after what she's going through. You feel me? But like, and she said she would feel a hundred times better if I did it. So I took it and I told her it's okay and like bless you and God's with her and I'll pray for her and all that stuff. And she said okay and like then she started crying again and she closed the window and I just kept walking. So on the way home, I'm still like, like that's just like that's like something so weird to realize just out of nowhere. You feel me? like like that just happened to you. So yeah, so then I'm like, oh shit, I just got some free fifty dollars and stuff. So. I went to my boy's house, and we copped some Pizza Hut and shit, and then we were just chilling. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's that's really the story. That wasn't really, like, inspirational or anything, but that's just literally a life event that happened to me. But, yeah, that's, like, one of the weirdest events to have ever happened to me, if I say so myself. So, uh, yeah, that's about it. Oh, I'm about to die right here, actually. Hold up. Yeah, so, uh, that's I guess that's it, guys. I uh, hope you, got, you guys enjoyed this life story. Uh, I'm gonna be trying to release a lot, truly trying to release a lot more videos. Cause I'm actually trying to like get into the YouTube scene. I'm gonna try at least with these life stories, cause I don't really know anybody else that makes life stories and like on RuneScape and stuff. So I'm gonna be trying to do that. Anyways, guys, um, if you enjoyed the life story, like and subscribe. Uh, and thanks for watching. And I'm out. Peace.